करत बेघरांना सन्मानानं जगता यावं यासाठी स्ट्रीट प्रोव्हिडन्स ही संस्था कार्यरत आहे मात्र अशा बेघरांना एका ठिकाणी आणणं हे देखील कायद्याच्या दृष्टीनं जटिल प्रक्रिया असते मात्र या कामात मागील बरीच वर्ष पोलीस खात्याचे अधिकारी सेराफिन डायस यांनी मोलाचं योगदान दिलं आहे त्यांनी दिलेल्या या योगदानाबद्दल आणि सेवानिवृत्त होत असल्यानं स्ट्रीट प्रोव्हिडन्सच्या वतीनं त्यांचा सन्मान करण्यात आला who has been involved with the homeless rehabilitation with us last 5 years guiding us teaching us putting us systems in place uh, helping us to work within the purview of the law and since it's its last day in office today he's retiring uh, we decided to publicly bring all up homeless people who he has helped us get off the streets and we'll be conducting a small farewell for him in front of his office somewhere in 2017 uh, donald came to me i didn't know donald so somebody referred donald to me a common friend and it was just an idea that uh, we could do something like this and uh, we could clear the streets of the homeless people who are living on the streets don't have anybody to take care of them and from there slowly slowly we started uh, picking up people uh, some uh, some uh, uh, nice uh, person uh, uh, willingly gave a small house to accommodate the people and uh, there there it started so i was uh, i am just a, a advisor sort of a thing uh, but uh, i could say that donald is helping the police department in a way because uh, any time some somebody sees a, a person on the street homeless person on the street living on the street you know, with no food no shelter no clothes people call the police department and as a police department we don't have anything to, to send those type of people uh, basically provedaria is there but uh, provedaria is always full so donald in a way started this and started helping us my job was to get in touch with all the police officers all the senior police officers the local police stations uh, to make them aware that yes we have a place where we can send these people instead of keeping them on the road and from then on it grew everybody started supporting police also started supporting police officers uh, station house in charge also started supporting and uh, it kept on growing today donald has six houses where he is taking care of these homeless people you must have noticed people uh, you must have been seeing in panjim on the streets uh, suddenly they are not there i can tell you 100% they will be with dohan so um, he has also started a home for the female uh, uh, ladies who are uh, who are uh, not having a shelter uh, it's only one house but i'm sure it will grow and uh, he has started a uh, different other things also like a food bank where fridges are kept uh, people can uh, deposit the extra food which can be served to the people who don't have a meal sometime back he also started a clothes bank where people uh, having extra clothes or old clothes could uh, deposit their clothes and do, that could be given to people without clothes meals are uh, almost served almost uh, even in the hospital premises outside the hospital it's been sell uh, 
serving free meals for uh, people who don't have food to eat and uh, he's been going on and on and on i hope and i wish him all the best uh, sir this uh, this activity has taken more of a emotional uh, involvement rather than your official role exactly so what would be your uh, i mean message to your fellow officers who will be taking over your role and your responsibility I in would, this activity i would appreciate if everybody starts lifting people from the streets and sending them to this homes where there are people to take care of them i can tell you there are most of the houses are today taken care of by those people who have come in earlier as homeless so a person who's coming in today is taken care of by somebody who's already there and was picked up as a from the street for not having a house for not having shelter so it becomes a, a sort of a chain and uh, police officers i would suggest i would uh, request everybody to make sure that there is nobody on the street nobody goes should go homeless or sleep on the street uh, where he is uh, out when uh, in the sun in the rain so people uh, police officers should uh, look around in their areas and make sure that this type of people are taken care of lifted from the spot where they are living on the street and sent to a shelter home so that uh, they are taken care of and they live a peaceful life you can see most of them are looking very healthy now and, uh, they are happy